Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We finally did it. We filled our Jazbees 27 box value packed basketball mixer. This, I don't know what people were sleeping on this break a little bit, but I think today they finally, uh, they finally realized what this is all about. Yeah, our top loader bill for this break probably will be insane. I got a huge stack right here as well. The mixer includes everything below. No vet commons ship except for Lucas, LeBron's, Giannis's, and Kobe's. Great rookie chase here. Zion, Ja, Tyler Hero, Kobe White, Rui Hachimura, Jason Tatum, De'Aaron Fox, Donovan Mitchell, Jalen Brown, Ben Simmons, Clay Thompson, Damian Lillard, Bradley Beal, Anthony Davis, Kawhi, and, and more, more, more. Right? Because of these old, old boxes right here. And we're also going to go from oldest to most current. So we'll close out with the Hoops Premium, the 10 boxes of that. All right. Big thanks to everybody here for getting into the action. I really appreciate it. All right, and congrats again to all of the, uh, the the winners of spots as well. All 30 teams are in. No combos. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Three and a six, nine times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And once more, right? Three and a six, nine times. Yep, again, nine times. Gretchen down to Kobe. Three and a six, nine times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. Pacers down to the Mavs. Now trades are allowed if you want, but remember with all the different years, trade at your own risk. All right, Gretchen with the Pacers, Kevin with the Heat, Wes with the Nets, Colton with the Rockets, Kobe with the Hawks and Grizzlies, Robert with the Kings, Sean with the T-Wolves, Martin with the Wizards, James with the Bulls, Jake with the Bucks, Martin with the Jazz, Kobe with the Pistons, Mike with the uh, Pelicans, nice, Natalie with the Hornets, Kobe with the uh, Warriors and Spurs, sorry, no, no 20, 20, 20, 21, but like Devontae Graham hunting in some of the other years. Kobe with the Warriors and Spurs, Matthew with the Celtics, Josh with the Trailblazers, Shane with the Knicks, Dante with the Magic, Colton with the Sixers, Kobe with the Clippers, Greg with the Suns, Robert with the Cavs and Nuggets, Jeff with the Thunder, Chris with the Raptors, Robert, you got my Lakers, and Kobe with the Dallas Mavericks. I think they're going to be on NBA TV a little bit later tonight. Let's get all this on one page here. Let's sort by column B right here. And let me know if there's any trades. In fact, I'll pause the video, get some of the boxes set up here. We'll pause the video and see if there's any trades. When we come back, we'll break. Stick around. All right, welcome back, folks. There was a lot of trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done here in the 27-box value-packed basketball mixer. So that list remains the same. Thanks, everyone, for getting in. We're going to go in chronological order from, from uh, oldest to newest. So we're going to do 12-13 Hoops Hobby first. And here it is. So I'm almost certain that there's two autographs per box. Of course, these go to the Lakers. I'm pretty sure this was the double year, right? This is pretty loaded with, with some pretty nice names here. This is where you'll get, this is where I think this is a Kawhi rookie year, Anthony Davis, Damian Lillard. You can get a nice rookie card and it grades out nicely. And you're going to be pretty happy.
Got Dallas Mavericks at Denver Nuggets coming up on NBA TV. If you want to tune your channels to that, we can watch that together. A lot of great autographs. I'm looking at the glancing at the checklist right now. It's pretty great stuff. I, th I want that's what, kind of what I was looking for because I noticed that Kyrie in one of these packs. I'm pretty sure Kyrie's a rookie in this as well. I want to say that this 12-13 set, because of the because of the NBA strike or lockout or whatever it was, I forget who who did what, but um, I want to say that they had combined two draft classes into one product year because of that. So I'm pretty sure it's a 2011 draft class and the 2012 draft class. So yeah, so if, so Kyrie should be a rookie in this. Kemba, Clay Thompson is a rookie in this. Kawhi, Jimmy Butler. And then 2012, yeah, I think I think 2012 was the Anthony Davis, Bradley Beal, Damian Lillard, Andre Drummond year. Wow, what a draft class! What those two years are. I think I think each one of these boxes nowadays are pretty are pretty expensive because of that. Right, I think I think there was a Kyrie early on. Trouble is with this set is that they're not. Um, is that they don't say rookie on it for some reason. Yeah, I forgot how many packs are in here. I think this break is going to take about an hour and a half, so hang tight, folks. Careful not miss too much here. Michael Kidd Gilchrist. I think the Lakers are still paying Luel Dang. So there's Kawhi Leonard, rookie Kawhi Leonard for the Spurs. We've got Klay Thompson for the Warriors. Kobe has the Warriors, and the Spurs are for Kobe as well. Nice. And of course, Heat edition of LeBron James. Nice out of go to Kevin. This Kemba is for Charlotte. Ooh, nice, Joe. That, that number block is getting close.
You know what? I think I might have the shipping team. No vet commons except for this. I think we might ship everything in this because there's no way to tell what the rookies are. Nelson, what's up? Dallas or Denver? Who's winning straight up? I say Dallas. All right. You got you got a little impatient. Well, it is locked on the schedule, but this is a pretty long break, so you're going to have to be patient, I'm afraid, Ryan. But thank you very much. Appreciate you buying that. And we've got an autograph. It's Marshawn Brooks. Nice. That'll be for the Nets. That's going to go to Wes Thomas. Nice rookie Bradley Beal. And rookie Anthony Davis. You don't remember Marshawn Brooks, Laser? Brandon, how late do we usually go? I usually go to around 9 o'clock Pacific. So we are almost kind of booked for the night after that Panini 1 break. But if, um, if that revolution sells out, I'm down to do that as sort of the last break of the night. There's Jimmer Fredette for the Kings. That'll be for Robert in Sacramento. Got another, we got a draft night, Anthony Davis, right here. Those will go to New Orleans, of course. That'll be for Mike. We got Kyrie Irving for the Cavs. Cleveland, this is for you. And there is Damian Lillard right there for Portland. Joshua tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. All right, and there's Jimmy Butler right there. James. Yeah, this is absolutely a, what I call a blessing in disguise, in, in disguise, man, because, I mean, had he not been traded, he had to go through all the physical. All right. Been, is that Jimmer Fredette, a rookie, maybe? Who knows what would have happened with that match, if it was, you know, thrown or did, just God forbid anything. So, I mean, I, uh, nice. I all those, of course, will ship. Nets or Lakers winning the chip, Laser is asking. Well, I'm a Lakers fan, so I'm biased. I can't really answer that question. Lakers, obviously. Right. I guess in all in all to be realistic, I think the the Lakers really need to 
have Anthony Davis and um, and LeBron to be 100% healthy. I mean, the team has to be 100% healthy. They don't their margin of error if they lose a player isn't very big. So, if and if the Nets are equally as healthy, it's gonna be it's gonna be a battle if they face each other. But and I have to admit. I was wrong about the Nets. I mean, I was just like, oh, who knows? I mean, could could the Nets with all those egos and all the, could they fall apart? But they haven't so far. But I guess they haven't really played a lot with KD just yet. So we'll see what happens when all three of them are, are, are together. Yush has a hot take. 76ers breakthrough this year. It's another team. That's that's another team where they got to have, they got to have um, Anthony, Anthony Davis. They gotta have Joel Embiid completely healthy. They don't have a, a margin of error if Davis doesn't go down. You don't think 100% Lakers can can run with 100% Nets? Yeah, that might be a tough series. Lakers got to, I mean, you got to assume that the Lakers are going to do something in the trade window, though, on the 25th or 28th, at the end of the month, because they see they see the upgrades all the other teams have made, especially the Nets, and how they're looking with James Harden added to that team. So they, you know that the Lakers gotta, are going to try something. They're not, I don't think they're just going to stand pat. Yeah, Blake Griffin was an interesting, it, it'll be interesting to see, did he play today? It'll be interesting to see how Blake looks. I can't imagine he's going to get starter minutes, right? Like he's not playing 35 minutes a night, I doubt. But if he puts in like 15, 20, 25 quality minutes a night, coming off the bench, running that second unit, that could be pretty, that could be pretty dangerous if he's healthy and he can stay healthy. Excuse me. Throat's drying out a little bit. Sixers? If Sixers get someone like... like uh, Get a Kyle Lowry? That'd be kind of crazy. Barry, Barry saying 2013 Pinnacle game signatures to 99 Kevin Durant 45 auto PSA 9. Okay. That seems. What about it, Barry? I'm gonna say 2019, 2020 Panini Prism Luka Doncic autograph to 99 PSA 10. There you go. I can say cards too. Alvin Gentry. Jabal McGee. There's Blake right there. And our autograph, Damari Carroll. Oh, you're saying you have that card. This is not really not the place to uh, to sell to buy sell cards, Barry. If you join our Facebook group, though, you can you can tell tell people about that as, as much as you'd like, without spamming. 
Andy, um, I don't deal with it. Well, first off, we're closed tomorrow. And I don't handle the uh, the pickup process. You're going to have to hit the contact button on jazbeescasebreaks.com and let us know um, that you want to pick up. And then we can get back to you and tell you when it will be ready for picking up. And we can put you on our uh, pickup only list too. If you want, there's Damian Lillard, Trailblazers for Josh, and another Kyrie rookie. Both rookies. And for the Celtics, we got Greg Stiesma. Oh, that's why you're so concerned about teams, <laughs> not uh, about teams not uh, playing hard or blowing teams out. You need the Blazers to win by nine and a half or more. Dallas to win and Pacers to win. So that parlay will get you 10k. Parlays are rough. Well. I think I'm with you on, on Dallas. I think they're going to win. Trailblazers are winning. But they don't... Trailblazers haven't... They need CJ... I don't think CJ McCollum's back, right? So I think since CJ McCollum's been out, I think it's been a little difficult for them to really blow out teams that they should. Andrew Bynum. Although the Mavs are not starting off very hot. They're already down 9 nothing. at the start of the game. Come on. All right, Miami, Kevin with the LeBron James, Wizards, Martin, Bradley Beal, rookies. And of course, Anthony Davis for New Orleans. Jimmy Butler, rookie. James O. in Chicago. Flipping these cards right side up, upside down. There you go. Not bad. Some nice rookies there in these two hoops boxes. See what's in those Kobe packs. Sometimes these could be autographed or even numbered. Not this group here. These will all go to the Lakers, of course. That'll go to Robert. R.I.P. Kobe. Okay, so that was 2012-13.
Now let's move to the next year, 2016. Aha, uh -huh. bam. So we're doing all 10 boxes. There you go, all 10. So 2016 is the Ben Simmons year. And who else was in 2016? Jamal Murray, maybe? Ben Simmons, Brandon Ingram, Jalen Brown, DeMontis Sabonis, Pascal Siakam, among others. There you go. Yeah, Jamal Murray was the seventh overall pick. Buddy Heald is even an interesting one here, too. Continued to grow. Which LeBron? We don't have a. I don't think we have a LeBron on eBay. All right. We got some final scores here, maybe. Yeah, I wish they wish they wish the NBA TV had Bucks Wizards on national television. Bucks one twenty five. Beating uh, the Wizards in Washington, one 125 to 119. Giannis, 33 points, 11 rebounds, 11 assists, triple double. Russell Westbrook, 42 points, 10 rebounds, 12 assists. Man. You got the Raptors. Nice. Finally. All right, so I think we are we are booked up for the night, folks. So I just I'm updating the schedule right now, so you can check that uh, pinned in the chat. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a fan of Westbrook as well, Barry. I always wish that he would... Uh, he played at UCLA. He was pretty pretty great at UCLA. I always wish that he would end up back with the... La or he would end up with the Lakers. But. 
think once he signed that monster deal, I, didn't, I don't think I don't think the Lakers would have ever been able to to sn snatch him up. Let's go. So I think there's Valanchunas. So this was back when they called it Prism Mosaic. Before it ended up being the mosaic that we know and love today. Some of these cards are kind of sticking together here. There he is, Westbrook in his in his OKC gear, still in OKC back then. DeAndre Jordan, we got a buddy healed for New Orleans blue. Nice Giannis. There's a Ben Simmons. These Ben Simmons are important because um, Ben Simmons autographs are exclusive to Upper Deck. So consequently, his rookie cards and Panini sets have just a, an, an extra boost in value. I feel like him and the team has been playing pretty well, so that's that's important too. We got Wayne Baldwin the fourth rookie autograph for the Grizzlies. That's going to go to Kobe Chan with that one. There you go. Nice Brandon Ingram. Still Lakers edition here. That goes to Robert. Most improved player of the year was awarded to him last year. There's Jalen Brown right there. He's having a great season this year. That's for the Celtics, Matthew Shearer. Jamal Murray, nice. Behind Wade Baldwin, Kevin Love. DeMontis Sabonis. Sabonis was, a, was an OKC? Wait, I think, I think at one point they were all together, right? Sabonis, James Harden, Kevin Durant, and Westbrook. Imagine if that team stayed together like three or four more years. Jeez. That Sabonis goes to OKC, Jeff Dorlach. And there's Jamal Murray right there for Denver, Robert Runkle. I think they might they might have had Steven Adams on that team too. Well, that's big to hit some threes early to get the confidence going. So 20 to 13 is our score. We are told that Jamichael Green and Zeke Naji are available. All right, we've got a handful of nice Jamal Murrays here. Richardson. Don't think he's a great three-point shooter. Just 30% so far this season. Now Barton loads up a triple. Got Cavs, LeBron James for Cleveland. That'll be for Robert. So a couple nice Jamal Murrays, including that red one. Those aren't numbered, but they're still nice, Robert. A lot of stuff that's, that could be worth grading once you put in, put your eyeballs on these, ladies and gents. Dwayne Wade is numbered. That's the 24. And these red ones aren't. All those buddy heels going to New Orleans. That'll be for Mac. 
And we've got Kay Felder. Rookie auto for the Cavs. Robert Cleveland, this is for you. Nice uh, camo, Dwayne Wade. Bulls Dwayne Wade, that moment that he was there. That goes to James. James O with that one. All right, another five boxes. All right, another five, another five to go. And we'll get to some of the other boxes as well. Let's see, what other final scores do we have? We've got the Hornets beat the Raptors 114-104 to 104 earlier today. Anything special happen here? LaMelo Ball, 23 points, 9 rebounds, 6 assists. He had a great first quarter, a steal, a block. Lamelo Ball has, uh, has been a great surprise. That's a great pick by Jordan and his team, right? I feel like Michael Jordan has been criticized as, as him and his front office not really identifying good talent. I think they finally got it with, with LaMelo Ball. Devontae Graham, who's also pretty underrated on the, Charlotte, on the Charlotte team, he had 17 points in 17 minutes. It's pretty great. He went 5 for 9 from 5 for nine from 3 pointer from 3 point land in those 17 minutes. Wow. Malik Monk had 16 points in 19 minutes. P.J. Washington only had 11 points tonight. But six rebounds, three assists, two steals, a block. Plus minus, plus 21. So he did it on the defensive side of things today. It's pretty good. Nets beat the Pistons. 100 to 95. Mason Plumley for the Pistons almost had himself a triple double. 11 points, nine rebounds, six assists. James Harden, 24 points, 10 rebounds, 10 assists. Yeah, a lot of triple doubles tonight. Knicks cruised against the Thunder. Are the Knicks going to make the playoffs, ladies and gentlemen? I would love for that to happen. That's hashtag good for the hobby. Especially when Julius Randle is putting up 26, 12, and 12 tonight. Woo! 26 points, 12 rebounds, 12 assists, a couple steals. R.J. Barrett, 32 points, 5 rebounds, a few assists, a few steals. That's pretty great. Who else? Emmanuel Quickly, 21 points, 3 rebounds, 4 assists, a couple steals. That's great. Those are those are your those are your main guys on the Knicks. Emmanuel quickly in current 2020 2021 product. RJ Barrett in 2019 2020 product. For him, Thunder weren't really doing too much work, but unfortunately. stuck together right here but we got a rookie auto Henry Allenson for Detroit that's going to go to Kobe there's Julius Randle right here when he was on the Lakers I think his rookie year was the year before 15-16 Brandon Ingram is here in this this year 16-17 
It's for Robert and the Lakers. I don't know how long Ben Simmons is out for. I, I, I want to say that the that they're supposed to be both Embiid and Ben Simmons should be back on Sunday. Well, I think they're playing tomorrow. Siakam's actually not bad right there. Toronto. It'll be for Chris. Got a Malcolm Brogdon rookie autograph for the Bucks. That will be four for Jake in Milwaukee. And you'll get all the Giannis's out of here too, out of all these boxes in this mixer. Nikola Jokic is so good. Yeah, I think if Jamal Murray gets a little more consistent, Michael Porter Jr., man, that guy, that guy can do it all. If he can get some consistency, that's going to be a terrifying team. And then along with Nikola Jokic just running things, being the main guy, that's going to be a pretty scary team in the playoffs. I feel like they've got a decent bench, too, Denver. Nice. A LeBron James and another Ben Simmons for the Sixers. Colton Stanley with a couple Ben Simmons rookie cards out of here. I wouldn't be surprised if that, if those two right there could cover like a good chunk of your spot. Well, actually, you 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 got into a you won this spot, but so even better. Panda is saying keep an eye on Keldon Johnson. There's a Zach Levine camo. Yeah, I like. Keldon Johnson's been pretty pretty good too. You know, all those youngsters, Popovich is going to turn one of those guys into into a superstar, you know what I mean? He's going to develop one of those guys into a superstar. It might be might be Keldon Johnson. We're going to like we might look like 3 or 4 years later and be like, "Wow. Keldon Johnson is just it's killing it." All right, there you go. Another Sabonis for OKC. That'll be for Jeff. And let's move on. All right, so we got that done. We got that done. Now let's move ahead of season to 2017-18 Chronicles basketball. Five boxes of that. So it's half of this case right here. Slide these cards back over here. <laughs> Barry saying maybe maybe Murray seems to play better when facing elimination. Yeah, maybe he needs, needs that pressure, or he might just be putting too much pressure on himself. But the quality we know is there. So, I mean, that's the thing, it's consistency, right? 
All right, we've got one, two, three, four, yeah, five boxes on the left and right side. So let's select a die. And we'll use that flamingo one right there. One, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. Six, one, two, three, four, five, six. We're doing this side. These, I don't know, we'll save for some other time. Good luck, folks. We're about at the 45-minute mark of this break. I think we've got about another, oh, I don't know, hour to go. So hang in there. Schedules in the chat, folks. We are booked for the night. You can see specifically when your break is going to happen if you check the schedule. But the quick summary is we're going to do this, then limited football, um, then Panini one football then Revolution Basketball, then we're going to call it a night. By then we'll know what's happened to all of Brandon's parlays, and we can discuss all the other games that are in progress right now. Now you've been seeing a lot of these Chronicle 2019-2020 Chronicles in... Uh, in your filler breaks, this is actually finally seeing some Chronicles hobby here. All right, what else happened today? Trailblazers. Up 123 to 119 with uh, on the Timberwolves with 13 seconds left. No, maybe it's the end of the game. I think I might have had the Timberwolves plus five on this one if that score line holds the same. Hawks beat the Kings 121 to 106. De'Aaron Fox, 32 points, 7 rebounds, 6 assists. And Clint Capella, 24 points, 14 rebounds, and an assist. That's a nice game for him. Started off the season so hot, I want to say, but they've they've slowed down a little bit. I think their defense has been been a struggle for them. That hasn't been helping them stay in games. A lot of minuses on that plus minus. But Fox had 32 points. You know they can score. How did Halliburton do? Tyrese Halliburton, 24 minutes, only eight points, but a few rebounds, four assists, a couple steals. So remember, this is 1718 on the draft class. So let me skip one year ahead on the Wikipedia. So this is the Jason Tatum, the Markel Fultz, Lonzo Ball, Jason Tatum, basically Jason Tatum, Donovan Mitchell, Bam Adebayo. There's some other players that could be interesting in here too. De'Aaron Fox is a rookie in here. Um, Dennis Smith Jr. is a rookie in here. Jared Allen. Kuzma. So let's see if we can find those guys. We've got Jonathan Isaac, 90 out of 99. Piece of his jersey. Going to Orlando. That'll be for Dante. There's Kuzma to 199.
Tobias Harris and Caleb Swanigan to 199 jersey and autograph. That'll be for Portland, Josh Cherry. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. And we'll have all these top loaded before they go out, of course. As, as it said in the, uh, the description for this, <laughs> this is going to blow out our top loader budget. There's Draymond to 299. And Tony Bradley for the Jazz to 199. Brandon, I'll take partial blame for that. I realize that I, I was on the I was on Minnesota plus five. There's Hardaway Jr. to 149. Dirk Nowitzki to 199. And Steph Curry, 197 to 199. Golden State will be for Kobe. And here's De'Aaron Fox. Nice Fox in the box. Dan Smith Jr. to 249. Dallas. Dallas, that'll be for Kobe Chan. Those Dan Smith Juniors, that'll go to you too. De'Aaron Fox, Sacramento Kings. Robert Runkle with the Kings. Right, Steven Adams. And Jonathan Isaac. Autograph. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Dante. It's 111 out of 199 on this autograph. And Jonathan Isaac to 10. Tony Bradley. Kuzma in a limited basketball design. I wish I actually did limited basketball. That'd be pretty cool. Tobias Harris, Brooke Lopez to 199, Just, Justin Jackson autograph to 199, Sacramento, Robert, the, uh, two, other friend, two other teams you picked are always winning in the one team part, those parlays are rough though, parlays are tricky, um, because they, that, I mean, they, the house always wins, right? So those parlays, especially when you're getting plus odds, plus money on the money line, you're like, yeah. But these three or four outcomes, all they have to do is happen, and then, and then I'm winning. You know, but there, there's always that one out of the three, one out of the four that's always going to screw you up. I think last Saturday, Sean Jaspi was, was, was bragging about how he has this – this three team, this three card parlay for the fights that night, and he's like, "No way, these are gonna lose." You know what I mean? And he won the first two, lost the last one, and that was the one I think that was supposed to be his lock. I think <laughs> it happens. Those parlays can can can. You know, the hey, trust me, I've been on the wrong side of it too. The house can suck it. Um, there's Dirk Nowitzki going to Dallas. It's Kobe. There's Tony Parker, Josh Jackson, but. I've been on the I've been on the wrong wrong side of that, but but yeah, they're 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 very seductive. Yeah, I know, and we always keep. I, trust me, I I keep doing them too. I do parlays more often in in, in football. I feel like there's in the NFL. I feel like there's so much too much variance for me. And a Markel Fultz autograph. Nice one for Philadelphia. Colton. I really thought that Markel Fultz, this was his year. This was going to be, he's going to win comeback player of the year and all that, but I guess I'll have to wait another year after he did his ACL. Poor guy. Lori Markinen's a rookie here too. That guy still has a, has a ceiling. If he, 
Lori Markinen puts it all together. That could be a really great player. That goes to the Bulls, James O. It's Clay Thompson to 99. Bad setback for him. There's Tyler Dorsey to 199. That'll be Kobe and the Hawks. There's Kuzma again for the Lakers. Robert has my Lakers. We got blue Derek White. Where's the number on that? Oh, it's on the back to 199. This is this seventeen eighteen chronicles. This was when everything was kind of all over the place. Sometimes the numbers are on the front, sometimes the numbers are on the back. They really they really tightened up the product over the years, though. There's Jeff Teague to one ninety nine and Frank Jackson for the Pels to one ninety nine. It's going to be going to Mac, Mike McCarthy with that one. Yeah. The front of the front of the card looks like it should be the back of the card. I think they're trying to experiment with like chronicles, you know what I mean, like a newspaper kind of kind of vibe, but it was a good start, though. I think this might have been the first year of Chronicles. First year they ever did. But then 2018-19 looked even better, and then 2019-20 is really strong, and this year could be one of the best years yet for Chronicles. Nothing too monstrous yet, Brandon, but a lot of potential monsters because we pulled a lot of rookie cards from 2012-2013. And if those grade out nicely, then they could be the monsters of the break. But been pulling some nice stuff. A couple Ben Simmons cards out of 2016 product in this mixer. So a lot of potential for monsters if those grade out nicely. That's to 199. That'll be for the Suns. Greg with Phoenix. A lot of numbered cards here too. Yeah, there you go, Jamal Murray. Bradley Beal and Marc Gasol jersey. Uh oh, we got Brandon S, Brandon R. We'll have to do like we'll have to do some sort of uh, that goes to Memphis. That'll be for Kobe. We have to do some sort of Hunger Games thing. Last person standing gets to be the Brandon here at Jaspies. Dario Saric and Frank Tilakina. Jersey and autograph for the New York Knicks. 73 out of 199 for Shane in New York. There's John Collins. This is actually pretty nice. I like John Collins. 44 out of 99. Two-color jersey and autograph. Kobe Chan with the Atlanta Hawks. There's Ana Obi. Got Zach, different Collins. Zach Collins. Donovan Mitchell. 
I feel like we haven't seen a lot of Donovan Mitchells in this. James Harden to 199. Dwayne, Dwayne Bacon. Mmm, Bacon. This is a guy that I think that I think may, may have got hard done by by the pandemic as far as opportunities go for basketball, for as far as opportunities in, in athletics go. He had scored, he was on a hot streak in the G League before things shut down about almost 12 months ago. So I think there was a night where he had scored like 40 points or 50 points in a G League game and he was averaging like 30 a night, I think, something like that for like a few games. And I was just like, oh, dust off your Dwayne Bacons because, you know, like he's going to, he's going to, you know, be called up and, and just be a monster. And then the pandemic shut everything down and now I don't, I don't know if Dwayne Bacons even with Charlotte now. All right. Almost done, ladies and gentlemen. So we are done with 2017-18. And now we're going to get into 2019-20 Hoops Premium Hybrid Hobby. Which is right here. Scoot some of these sleeved cards out of the way and we'll have all these top loaded, of course, before they're sorted out. Oh, he's still with Charlotte? Oh, okay. Hobby Hybrid. So this is a 20 box case, so we're doing 10 of them, so we're doing half of this case. Right. Why do I not remember Hoops Hobby Hybrid? Oh, it looks like that. I remember it now. Well, maybe this break is shorter than I thought. Maybe I was thinking of regular hoops. All right. So there's two, four, six, eight, ten on the left and right side. So we'll select a die. Let's select that that one. Bellagio die. One, two, three for the left stack, four, five, six for the right stack. And it's two. So we're gonna do the left stack right here, and this right stack we'll do some other time. Maybe these will turn into mixers or end up being sold on the shop floor at Jaspies or personals, who knows? All right, so there you go. There you go. Hybrid's got the H2 on there. And so now we're in the Zion John Morant year. No, William's saying the bacon is with the magic? Well, so, so which is it? Where, where is he? Where is he really? Yeah, I think you're, I think you're right, William. I, I'm pretty sure that he was no longer with Charlotte. Thought Dwayne was gonna have a chance. I thought I was gonna be able to to proudly announce, dust off your Dwayne Bacons. But alas, no. Karis LeVert. That's crazy. That, uh... Harris LeVert for it, which be crazy. Is he playing daily with, with Orlando, Dante saying? Oh, he's averaging, William's saying he's averaging 10, 10 and a half points per game. 
Good, du dust off your Dwayne Bacons. Let's get some more minutes for him. Let's get some more points for him. I want it all. So there you go. So Charlotte, that's Natalie, got that delicious, delicious bacon. So hopefully you're going to hold on to that card and hope. And now you're an Orlando Magic fan now. <laughs> you're just hoping for him to. You're hoping for him to go off. Like that stack is a little too slippery to be that high. Does anyone have any other? Uh... Oh, he's starting. Starting 25 of 38 so far. There you go. Bring home the bacon. You think Dwayne Bacon actually likes bacon, or do you think that just because it's his last name, he's just been teased about it for so long that he's just anti-bacon? Or are you think he embraces bacon? I'd like to think he could. I'd like to think he could. Uh, he could do like a local supermarket promotion, you know, and have like Dwayne's bacon or something like Dwayne's fresh cut, maybe if like fresh cut bacon or something like that. Dwayne's bacon. Gun says he loves bacon. Is that is that true? Does he have a Twitter where he says that? A tweet. High voltage Julius Randall. These reds are not numbered, by the way. Those Danny Greens, but they will ship. Oh, I remember doing these now. <laughs> it's all coming back to me. Everyone loves, everyone likes bacon, yeah. But I mean, it's a lot of, a lot of fat, cholesterol. Maybe his dietitian says don't, <laughs> don't eat so much bacon, Dwayne. Like, but that's me. That's my, that's my whole lifestyle. So you see how all of these cards have like people in the background, right? There, there is a background. So these, like this Kobe White. For the Bulls, James, these are the variations. Gun says, Dwayne called you and said, yeah, yo, tell tell Jaspies that I love bacon. Ooh, nice R.J. Barrett. And then hung up. R.J. Barrett, rookie ink. Nice one for the Knicks. Shane with the Knicks. There you go, man. Scored 32 tonight. And one. Could be in the playoffs. Man, you got to hold on to those those Knicks cards because when they get to the play, if they get to the play, I hope they get to the playoffs. That's going to be huge for card values, I think. If they're cheap, Brandon, and you like Logan Allen, why not? Lugans Dort is also pretty solid. OKC, Jeff. There's the Nasir Little to 99 for Portland. And here's Kobe White for the Bulls. James. Markeith Morris. There's our first Zion. Tyler Hero to 49. There's a rookie John Morant. Larry Nance, Anthony Davis. All right, so we got, we got some things going on here. Here's Zion Williamson Pelicans. That's going to go to Mac and Nolens. Right, so you had the Zion opportunities and those Anthony Davis rookie cards from earlier. Here's high flying John Morant, Memphis. Kobe Chan with the Grizz. Darius Garland's been playing pretty well, right? It's both him, Colin Sexton, and Darius Garland. <laughs> William doing some quality producer work here. He's saying Dwayne Bacon does like bacon on spicy chicken sandwiches per an interview he did in college. Nice. 
good. I'm glad. I'm glad I know that. So he's not been traumatized in his childhood about such such a last name. Tremont Waters, silver. Rookie silver for Boston. Matthew Shira, Nasir Little again to 99. Going to Portland. That'll be for Josh. John Stockton, 25, and there's R.J. Barrett playing some great basketball for the Knicks. Although I don't think his value has gone up as much as I thought it would, but I think there's still room, especially if they make it to the playoffs. New York will go crazy. There's this guy. It's unfortunate for him, too. Stockton for the Jazz, Martin. Josh Jackson, Willie Colley Stein. There's Pacers edition of DeMontis Sabonis. Damian Lillard, Nicola Melli. Danilo Gallinari. Triple J. Another John Morant here. All right, you see, guys, you guys see what Jalen Noel did the other night? I don't know what he did tonight. William's saying Nasir Little had Nas Little had a nice little dunk tonight against the Wolves. Let's see. We want we want the the these guys. Nice. Anthony Edwards in 2021 products. Uh, 16.7 rebound, 3 assists, a steal. Nice. Jalen Noel, 17 points in 28 minutes, a few rebounds, 5 rebounds, and an assist. I think he, he went off the other night, though. It's pretty good. That's for Minnesota. Sean Maddock will get that one. Gallinari is still OKC edition. That will be for Jeff. And... Kobe with Jock. All right, five more boxes to go. Another 15 minutes or so, and then we are Dunzos. Five more boxes here. I think Denver will make a move. I feel like... I feel like no... Nikola Jokic is so good and has just had incredible individual games, but but now Dallas is leading by 11. Although I was on, I was, I'm on on Dallas. I think that's the issue with Denver. That Jokic is so good, but but Jamal Murray really needs to be more consistent. Michael Porter Jr. really needs to start stepping it up. But I wonder if they'll make a deal, if they'll make a trade, just to kind of add to that team.
Precisely. Man, the announcer in the broadcast in the background. Um, I didn't. Someone else must have taken it. There, there's a knife in there somewhere. Ooh. All right. Let's hydrate these vocal cords. This is it. This is the end of the break, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Let's see what we got here. Here's this guy, right here to 49. There's Tyler Hero, variation. Kevin with the heat. This guy going to Robert and the Kings. There's Opala, there's Carl Anthony Towns, who had a nice game to, uh, tonight. He had 34 points, eight rebounds and a few assists, a steal, a block. Sean Maddock with Minnesota. Danny Green to 25. PJ Washington playing pretty well. It's for Charlotte. That's going to go to Natalie. Lakers, Danny Green. Pink parallel to 25. Lakers. That'll be for Robert. Kobe White for the Bulls going to James O. I really like what Talon Horton Tucker can do. It's Kevin Porter Jr. made his debut for Houston, I want to say, and uh, and did really well. Can someone confirm that? <laughs> I'm going to confirm it for you right now. There's Hachimura Silver for Martin. Yep, Kevin Porter Jr. in his debut with Houston. 27 points, a few rebounds, 8 assists, a steal, and a couple blocks. Over 38 minutes. It still goes to Cleveland, but that's good for the, it's good for the hobby there, Robert. Anthony Davis to 35. We need him back soon. We as in Lakers fans want to see him back soon. First supposed to be Anthony Davis news today. High voltage, Giannis, Silver Bacon. I think this uh, these high voltages I think are shorter printed. Sorry, Donovan Mitchell, that is. I was thinking Giannis. Uh, Martin with the Jazz. I guess as of today, Anthony Davis is going to be reevaluated in two weeks, but apparently things are progressing. Be a scary situation. Pat, is that going to be a regular thing for Kevin Porter Jr.? Are they expecting to play him that many minutes? Allow him to score that many points? There he is again. I feel like he was. I feel like he was kind of getting to a good spot. I don't know. He, he had a falling out in Cleveland, let's say. I think so too. I think Anthony Davis stuff, outside of his rookie stuff, like the stars, like you know, like uh, like LeBron James, his his cards across all all years will do pretty will do pretty well. You know, here's Jalen Horde for Portland. It'll be for Josh. But outside of his rookie stuff, I feel like Anthony Davis isn't as. 
That's hot, hobby wise. And there's Kyrie to 49 for the Nets. There's a high voltage DeMar DeRozan for the Spurs. Kobe Chan. Oh, Wall and, and Oladipo were out. Okay, okay, in that game. But it's clear that he belongs on the floor. All right, well, that's hashtag good for the hobby, ladies and gentlemen. And that's from a Houston fan, too. Kobe White. Damian Lillard. And we're going to close out with a 10 out of 10, Lou Williams. In this uh, lemon pepper parallel. Right? Lemon pepper. It's gold. Lemon parallel. All right. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That was Jaspi's 27 box. Basketball mixer. I know there's a lot of rookie cards and stuff like that that are in here at our back there. We had some Ben Simmonses, Anthony Davis. Eh, maybe I'll show you the er, the the early group. I think those are worth looking at. But here are the hits, relics and autos, and low numbered cards. Now these mosaics are pretty cool. There's some Ben Simmons rookie cards. Malcolm Brogdon autograph. Other Ben Simmons. Here are some early hoops autos as well. Those older years were, were pretty good. So these hoops cards, these are Jimmy Butler's. Are, uh, these are all rookies. Anthony Davis, Bradley Beal, not LeBron, not Kobe, obviously, but Andre Drummond, Kyrie, Damian Lillard. There's the Kobe packs. So that's that's a Clay Thompson rookie, Kawhi's a rookie. Those are all the 2012 set. And here's some other nice stuff from 2016. But there you go. And among other things right there, this is a pretty fantastic break. Um, this that's why there was so much value in these breaks and I appreciate people valuing this break getting in on it and getting in on the fillers to help fill the break I, I thank everyone for for helping make this happen I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com I'll see you next time for the next break bye bye